How are we all doing guys? Welcome back to the Fox's Den for another well needed shave today. Right, we've got some new products for you today. I have got uh, a new soap that I've been kindly sent. This is from, I don't know if you'll be able to scan that or not. This is from the Highland Soap Company. Scottish Handmade Soaps and Skin Care. We started making soaps and skin care in the Highlands of Scotland more than 20 years ago. Ever since then we have found we have focused on using organic ingredients and sustainable packaging. So that's pretty good to let me show you some other stuff. Look, soaps, candles they make and all sorts, so it's cracking stuff. Right, the soap that they've sent me, guys, is the Highland Soap Company, and it's um, it's uh, what do you call it? What do you call that gin? Juniper, juniper berry, and it smells. It's in a glass jar. The glass jar. I don't know if you'll be able to see. I'll put what's in it and what's not in it anyhow, and it just tells you batch number. And it's 175 grams, so that's including jar as well. And it's a rock hard soap. The scent is amazing. It's juniper, but it's so fresh. It's like a really, really fresh Scottish day, I would say, to be honest. Oh, it smells lovely. It really does smell nice. So we've got that today. Now, this has got some top reviews on it, this stuff has. Uh, uh, really, really five-star reviews all the way across board. Uh, there's just a couple that said it's, it dissipates, which it does say on, on the label, it does say that it's not a thick lather, but it's a creamy, uh, slick lather. So that's fine, you know what I mean? I'm not bothered about tons and tons of lather anyhow. Right, the brush that we're going to use today, going on vegan style stuff, is the Gentleman's Face Care Club. That's a 24mm uh, synthetic noise, lovely. I mean, one of my favourite brushes to be fair, and they're only 10 quid, 11 quid I think they are on Amazon. And it's one of my favourite brushes. Right, the razor that we're using today. Now this would be perfect, because my I've got, I've got have arthritis in my right hand really bad in my right hand and it clicks and cracks and I can't sometimes I can't make a fist now I saw this and I thought this is perfect for people who wet shave and who's got arthritis in their hands it's a really really thick so you can you can grip it if you want to use it like that it's got it's a lovely grippy handle on it so I mean it's a bit like a D89 head on it isn't it basically but uh, we've got a blade in, look, we've put a Nasset blade in. That's what we're using today. One of my favourite blades, Nasset. And we've put that in there. So you've got that in. Uh, three piece. It's pretty heavy. I'll put in in the in description what it is. It's a slight little bit of, light little bit of overhang. Not a lot, only a tiny little bit of overhang. So... Uh, and then we've got the splash is in the glass bottle. It's aqua velva, so I've put it in there now. Some of it, most, well, most of it. And for that, for that first um, balm, we've got this from the same company, Highland Soap Company, whiskey and honey. It is uh, absolutely amazing, amazing smell. You can smell the honey. Strong and a whiskey. It's lovely. It really is nice smell. Right, let's have a go. Well, get me brush into water. So we're not messing about today. We're going to get brush into water, and obviously we're going to lather out of this tub. Now we'll see what it goes like. So I don't know. Let's see what happens. Really, I should have bloomed this to be fair for a started like, but. Don't look that bad to me. It don't look bad at all, does it? Really. 
We'll see. Let's get plenty on brush. Once one of my bowls. <laughs> Look at it all. And we will see what it goes like. But he said it's fantastic stuff. Say every every review, apart from a couple that's just said it does dissipate, but it's a really, really nice uh, uh, lather. Not a thick lather, but a nice lather and uh, uh, slick. So we will see. Right, that'll go for that for the time being. Let's get my lads and lasses off. A uh, wet face. No pre-shave today, guys. This is that that razor is the Merca 40. Uh, and it's only cheap, it's only £12, £13, I think it is. The Merca 40. So let's have a go with this. I don't know where they get that stuck not leather. It is only a thin lather, but it's a good lather though. There's nothing wrong with that, is there? Yeah, I can see it's only a thin lather. Let's get back into this. A little bit more water on. And we'll see how we go with that. Get this blade warmed up. Right guys, I'll go across and see how we go on with this. Our oh, angle's great on it. I can feel the blade, but I don't mind that too much. Like I said, look, it's only a thin lather, which it is, but it's fine. It's, it's ever so slick. It really is slick. Razor's spot on. Merca, so it's not a bad razor if it's a Merca, is it? It's fine. Yeah, it's definitely slick, guys. Look at that. It really is slick soap. It's still wet. And look at it here, look. Smashing. Hey, I'll tell you what. Look at this. Oh, I could be using this regular. I ain't made a mess. No mess. Wow, we. <laughs> There's a novelty for me, isn't it? <laughs> she was really everywhere. Do you know, lad, that's got that guys, that's not a bad first pass that. That ain't a bad first pass. Let's go back to this puck and we'll uh, put a bit more on. I think what I should have done first, I should have uh, bloomed this a little bit first. A bit of hot water. But look at this, look. Still tons of lather in it. I don't like holding glass jars. <laughs> it smells. The scent is amazing. It's really, really fresh, really fresh smell. Junipers and talking of juniper. Well, it's not actually juniper, but it's near enough. Hang on. Dry my hands, I don't want my hands to get wet with and drop this. Cheers. Vodka and tonic. Tell a lie. It's vodka and lemonade. Oh. 
Mrs. says makes them by God, she does put some bloody vodka in. She don't. There's not much. <laughs> not so much lemonade in. Yes, yeah, so well, I'd like to thank the Island Soap Company for getting these to me. This could be a soap for me. I usually get it everywhere, as you know, guys. I have to shave my top every time I go in, go out for a shave. This is, to be honest, you don't need tons and tons of lather, do you? You know what I mean? Not for a good shave, you don't need it. And like I said before, I repeated myself, but the reviews it's got is, you know what I mean? It, it, everybody said it's five stars, it's great. Right, against the grain, guys. That's brilliant. That is great. Does the piss a bit, what do you call it, dissipate a bit. A bit. You've still got that slickness there. And at the end of the day, you don't want it, do you know what I mean? You don't, you don't want it absolutely dripping off your chin like I usually have mine. This is, that's really, it's, it's perfect, look. Look, it's absolutely perfect. I'm not wrong with that at all, guys. That soap's smashing, look at it. There's plenty, even without putting any more on. It's all right, there's no wrong with you, honestly. There really isn't. Let's just get it out of brushing. There's no wrong with that at all, guys. It's look, like I keep saying, sense, sense, outstanding scent. It really is. It's a lovely scent. This razor, is, like I said, it's perfect for somebody who's disabled who, who can't really hold a little thin razor. It's bang on. It's only mild. It is only mild, but... It does the job. Oh, look at this. Oh. Oh. How slick is that? And I'm not just saying it because I've been sent it for free. I'm not just saying that. I swear to God, I'm not. I promise you. That's fantastic. That is great. And there's no it's water. I've got water down me, obviously. But there is no soap suds down my shirt. It's love, lovely and slick, guys. I can understand why it's got five stars. As I've said, I'm, I'm not just saying that. I can understand it why it's got five stars. Let me just... Uh, have a rinse. <clears throat> Take 
prevents from getting off, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, I love it, it's great, really nice. A bit of cold. That's it. That's smashing. It's not BBS, but it's TFS, definitely. Lovely, absolutely lovely, guys. Let's have a bit of Mr. Allen if we can find him. He's here, look, he's here. He don't go very far away. That is smooth. I'll uh, put a link, obviously, to Island Soap Company, to their website. I don't know whether you'd be able to use it through that little, you know, little box, cube uh, for reference things. I don't know if you can use it through that for your phone. Uh, I'll put a link for that in. I'll put a link for that, that razor in. That has surprised me, that, to be fair. Like I said, it, it, it's perfect for somebody with arthritic hands or who can't grip out. Just to, even to use it like that, do you know what I mean? You can, you can still use it like that. It's a cracking little razor for 12, I think it's £12.95. Merker, can't go wrong, can you, really, for that price. But somebody who's just starting, you know what I mean? Just starting shaving and all like that. Like that soap, if they don't want massive tons of lather everywhere or all of that soap, I think it's 1995, I think it is, for a big jar. It'll last you forever, won't it? Uh, and that for 13 quid. You're laughing, aren't you? You are laughing. So, right, let me just rinse this off now. That's lovely. That really is. Honest reviews, guys. I've said it before on my other channel. On my 51 Foxy channel on YouTube. It's pointless doing a video review on anything if you're lying about it. Do you know what I mean? Because the people's going to buy it and they say, well, you said it were like this, you said it were like that. So it's pointless lying about it. Just tell the truth. If it's rubbish, say it's rubbish. If it's so so, say it's so so. But this soap, I will say to you again, is absolutely spot on. You don't get a massive lather, but you get so much slickness with it, and it's thin, and it doesn't dissipate really, does it? You know what I mean? It still stops to be it's thin, but it leaves a lovely coating. It leaves a really does slick coating on you. Oops. So I'll just wipe this off. Ah. Not wrong with that, guys. There's nothing wrong with that at all. I need a tash trim. Look at that. Ouch. No good when you pull it. <laughs> when you pull it, it's no good. Just have another quick drink of this. Oh, that's nice. Right. It looks like old fashioned poison, doesn't it? Well, I can't remember it, but that's what it used to be like blue, weren't it? Or green or something. I've got no restriction on this, so let's be careful with this. Hang on. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. It does, I think, I think John's right, you know. And, and Stephen Davidson, I think it does change. From what you were before, I can smell a bit of a tobacco in this now, for some reason. Oh, it's nice, guys. Really is nice. So that's that done. Oh, it's nice and cool and nice and menthol on your face, so it's lovely. So, we'll let that dry a second. In fact, we'll do a review while, uh, re while we're waiting for this to dry. Let me just... I'll get this glass jar dry and then I'm going to leave it open so it'll dry out then. 
the other razors come. That'll be choose to shave that. Not seeing it what it is yet. A couple on you know what it is. <laughs> That's all. Right guys, we have used the Highland Soap Company. Uh, uh, and it's what do they call it? Juniper berry. Juniper berry scent. It's lovely. It really is nice. It's a lovely, lovely, really lovely fresh scent. And I mean it. Lovely fresh scent. Comes in a nice glass jar with aluminium or aluminium lid on it. We got that. It was, we used the Gentleman's Face Care Club brush, which I'll put a link to that as well in the description. And the razor that we've used is the Merca 40 with the big handle. They do, they do have it in blue, blue handle. But this were off eBay. This is what only one they got. Uh, red handle, so I thought, I like red colour anyhow, so it's one of my favourite colours, so that was perfect for what I want. We've used the Nasset blade, one of my favourite blades, them and Treat, uh, Treat Black Beauty. We've used vodka. I've <sighs> used some of this blow after chef. <laughs> we use some aqua velvet in the glass jar. Thanks, John and Stephen, for that. Now we're going to use creme de la creme. This, this smells absolutely amazing. Let me try and rip it off from the other end. That's it. This is cracking stuff. Let's try and hang on. Get that off there first. That's it. Because usually I put tons of stuff on, don't I? Oh, look at this lot. Oh, this. Oh, my God. Oh, that smells fantastic. I'll have to buy some of that. I've got to buy some of that. I'm terrible for. Oh, for um, bombs and things like that. I've got to buy some of that. That is. That is one of the best smelling bombs. Like I said, I'm not just saying it. It's one of the best smell, smelling balms that I've got, that, definitely. Oh, it's only one little packet at all, <laughs> nightmare. I'm going to have to order some of that, therefore, definitely I'm going to squeeze back it out if there's any left in. Whiskey and honey, it's hand and body lotion. Oh, it's really, really, really nice. And there's absolutely tons to do your face and... Everything. Oh. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, I can't get off sniffing that. The bet that in the soap. I would definitely have that in my favourite soap. Well, one of my favourite soaps, anyhow. So, right, guys, that's it for this one. So... Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. It don't cost you not to subscribe. Uh, and I keep bringing different razors and soaps and everything to the channel to try and make it a bit varied, make it a bit different. Uh, you don't want to be using the same razor and the same soap all the time. You know what I mean? I'm going to keep it varied a little bit. So, my next shave now will be Tuesday. But um, I'm going to have a head shave off camera. That will be Monday, hopefully. Uh, uh, we've been out all day working on van today, getting all van ready to sell it. So, we'll uh, we'll see you all Tuesday for a face shave with my new razor from the good old US of A. Woohoo! Right, guys, thanks for watching. Love y'all.